my name is Amanda Wilchin and I did a summer abroad program in Russia through St. Cloud State University in the summer of 2014. I had always wanted to study abroad and after I finished my sophomore year I thought it would be a great time for it. So I found a program in Greece. It all boiled down to essentially the time where I needed to figure out how the heck I was going to pay for everything. So I went to my dad who co-signs for my loans to pay for my tuition and I talked to him about it and asked him to sign off on it and he refused. He thought it would be the worst idea in the world and a waste of money. It wasn't until the beginning of my senior year that I decided to I was going to do something about it. You know, my dad, he's an old-fashioned guy. He's a businessman, so I needed to present him with facts and figures. I gave him articles from the New York Times, you know, present him with anything and everything that there is to show him that studying abroad is a necessity for students and it's crucial to their college experience. Then I found the program in Russia. It's almost difficult for me to describe in words what an incredible experience studying abroad is. I learned something new every day and it was applicable to that day's activities, which all in all kind of made everything come full circle. The program really challenged me in ways that I, I didn't truly expect. It forced me to really break down my own personal barriers and to become more open. And our group really became close because of that. I truly feel like I have lifelong friends. This is literally like a roller coaster. It's very thrilling in its own way. Uh, you have your ups and you have your downs, you have your highs, your lows. But it's all about your own personal journey. And when you're finished, I hope, like me, uh, you know, you can say that you've gained life experience, independence, and confidence that you really, for me, I didn't have before, and I truly don't think that there's any other way that you can obtain it. After graduating, I, and keep in mind, I had no English teaching certification whatsoever, but I applied to be a North American English language auxiliary. And because of that, I had my tourism major, but because of my study abroad experience, I was accepted into the program and I'm currently working in Spain. I am so thankful to have had the opportunity to study abroad. I wouldn't be here teaching English in this beautiful town or have been as open or prepared for cultural immersion it, had I not partaken in that experience. And it, more than that, it's just, it's given me incredible life experience that I truly believe I couldn't have obtained any other way. And for that, I am just incredibly grateful.